Justine Frischman has a crucial role in the Britpop story. Not only did she have her own band, Elastica, but prior to that she was a guitarist in Suede and the girlfriend of their lead singer, Brett Anderson. She met Brett at University College London while they were studying architecture and he had just started to write songs with a particularly English quality about them. So what was it in Brett's lyrics that back then even kind of set Suede apart from what else was around? There was a kind of um, vision of a almost a uh, character like Proof Rock, you know, T.S. Eliot's uh, Proof Rock, a kind of downtrodden Englishman with an incredible kind of romantic interior life. I knew what I wanted, or more than anything, I knew what I didn't want. And, um, you know, just from being in Sway for years, I knew I didn't want to be anything with guitar solos. Mike Smith, who is um, uh, Blur's publisher at EMI and Alaska's publisher, um, gave us this tape and said, oh, you know, it's the next big thing. And me and Damon had listened to it and we were just like, this is rubbish, it was cigarettes and alcohol. And I was like, it just sounds baggy, it's rubbish. And Damon, as usual, kind of hating anything that could possibly be threatening in any way, was just like, yeah, it's, you know, it's shit and stuff. And we called up Mike and we were like, it's rubbish, don't sign it. I remember seeing the term Britpop, I think maybe it was the NME, and just having this horrible feeling that it was going to catch on. Mm -hmm. 